morning, church family. The prayer mic is now open, so we can start lining up against the wall and intercede for our community, intercede for our church, intercede for um, the surrounding communities as well. And this morning, I just woke up with the word, um, a new thing, and that's not something new that we've heard. God is doing a new thing. And um, as a church, I feel like we are pregnant, and we are just about to give birth. And this new thing is just going to be amazing. It's going to be super. It's going to be exciting. So just put on your seatbelts and let's go for the ride. I don't have a word or a picture. But I just want to say that I love the Lord. And Jesus Christ did die for us and rose again. Embrace his love and spread the word. Yeah, so the new thing is, is, we know that God's doing a new thing. And this morning, I got a picture of like the sword in the stone, right? And that the stone, it, it held that sword. But when he came up and he grabbed it and he pulled it out, he became king. And that took courage and it took bravery to know that he could pull that stone out. So I declare today that the bravery, the courage to do this new thing is in this house. It's over all of us. It's over South Jersey. It's over everyone that's there. And people are going to know that each one of us has a sword and a stone to the anointing and the calling that God has for us in Jesus' name. Yes, the Lord is doing a new thing. It is so real and so tangible. I can feel it and I can taste it. And the Lord says, it is coming. It is coming and it is, um, it's, it's in the distance, it's coming in Jesus' name. I declare that today and forevermore that our church family is forever known as gold seekers and unconditional lovers of people. And whenever we are near people, they know the love of the Father. I declare that the Lord is right now releasing finances. He's releasing wealth into his children, into the kingdom. So right now we receive physical resources. We receive finances. And we say, yes, God, that you are the provider. Supernatural provisions are right now behind the scenes to fruition in your life. I declare that we are going to be experiencing breakthrough, and a breakthrough is going to be strong enough for us to dream dreams that we've been afraid to dream. So dream on! Yeah, I partner with those words. I just declare again that today is a day of breakthrough, and that it is so imminent. God, we just say yes to your breaking through in this place, in this area, God, that it's over started, but that it is so eminent to be so big, so we receive it in Jesus' name. Amen. Yes, Lord. I just agree with all those, and especially Jan's word, oh, to dream dreams that are bigger. And I release this morning the truth that God has goodness for you that is greater than you can even imagine. So I just release that kind of, I just send it out like a call throughout all of Stratford and our entire region, that today is up. You're planting seeds and you're stirring up those seeds and you're saying, yes, yes, I'm better than you've expected and I've got good things for you. So Lord, I just declare that your goodness would now reach out to those people and bring them here this morning, Lord, that they would come and they would experience you in a new way. In a new thing. Amen. I declare there is health in this place, that we have strength and stamina and rejuvenation in Jesus' name. This morning I bless this church, I bless Stratford, but I go beyond that. I bless Cherry Hill, Camden County. It's all ours. We have authority. We own it. The Lord, I looked up something because I came upon a person that was discussing a baptism this week with me. So I went to look those things up, but the Lord took me somewhere else. And he talked to me about Acts 43, the baptism in the Holy Spirit. And this is what the verse says. And with great power, the apostles gave witness. That's us now, we give witness. the resurrection of Jesus and great grace was upon them. We need boldness, which is not human, it's divine boldness, and power from the Holy Spirit. I just got the
this picture of um, just digging, this uh, guy digging. I just saw that it was our church. They were digging into the soil and digging up the dirt. And then it, um, just literally water is breaking out. And that's how wells are made, just from digging into an atmosphere. And then the water just breaks through. So I just speak that right now as we dig into the atmosphere that there's a there's a increased measure that is enough to make a well in Jesus' name. God gave me the word giving today. He's giving us his love. And he wants you to take a hold of it and never let it go. So take hold of the love that God gave us. I declare that God is in a good mood. That God is good. He's goodness. He's a God of justice. He's a God of liberty. He's a God, God of hope. He's the God of forgiveness. words of the song that today is a day of yes that we are just going to stop with the uh, trying but we're going to say yes to what God wants to do in our hearts I got the word engagement this morning that Papa God is asking his kids to be in a relationship with him and that the children are going to say yes in Jesus name we declare today that arise and shine for the light is coming the glory of the Lord has risen upon us and what that looks like is that God is glory cloud is around this area and there's an attraction right now I declare in Jesus name spiritual life for people to come for people to just enter in without fear and experience the joy of the Lord. I got this picture of um, just a guy that's pulling back an arrow and then I saw on the arrow that it was a dreams it was multiple dreams and the more we we go into God's arrow when he pulls back and we believe that he can increase it he'll increase the distance back and he'll launch us so we can bring breakthrough in atmospheres. Yeah, so there's something happening because I got a picture in the back and it was like when the when the birds when they fly south for the winter that the birds that were flying they were like an arrow and how they come into formation but these birds were doves these birds were not geese they were doves and that's the Holy Spirit and it's coming this way it's here right now the doves were ascending on the people of South Jersey there were salvations happening there was right now there's baptism with the Holy Spirit happening right now in South Jersey there are people right now that are feeling their spirit come alive right now and I just say wake up South Jersey